ETSU investigative reporter Aubrey Killian picks up our team coverage. He just uncovered chilly bo chilling body camera video from the deputies actually accused of manslaughter the night Daniel Valley was killed. Yeah, Aubrey, it is the video that jurors actually watched in the trial yesterday as part of the evidence, right? That's right, and I want to warn you, the video I obtained, it is graphic. We are not showing the moment that Daniel Valley was killed. His family, they have filed a lawsuit in federal court. The video is part of that record, and that is how I uncovered it. DSU investigates, uncovering multiple angles from JPSO body cameras from February 16th of 2022. Deputies asked Daniel Valley to turn his car off, unlock the door, and step out. Valley asks what is he being stopped for and says he's not causing any trouble. He has his hands up in the video. About 12 minutes into the video we obtain, the car is turned back on. And about a minute later, he hits the horn. Deputies open fire. We want to warn you again, this video is graphic and disturbing. Y'all good? Anybody, y'all good? And according to the suit, again, Valley was not armed. Watch WDSU News at 10 o'clock to see and hear from more from those deputies and how all of this unfolded. That's at 10 tonight. Back to you.